What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Mojo Hookah Lounge. There is a lot of accessories on the hookah market these days and one of them is a special hookah fork. Today we're gonna go over it and uh, see what this fork is used for. Hookah fork might just look the same as a regular household fork. The only difference is a sharp edge on opposite side of the fork and it looks a little bit flat. Comparing to regular household fork, you can see it. The sharp edge, it's made for multi-purposes. You can make a hose when you're packing the foil or you can mix your tobacco, make a hole inside of your bowl. Multifunctional fork for many purposes. I wanted to say why people are using fork, but I would say why we using fork when packing a bowl. Because there is a lot of people out there in the hookah industry who still pack a bowl using your fingers, hands, who use forks and all the other different techniques. In my opinion, few reasons why we're using fork is because it's easy to fluff out your tobacco, take your tobacco out of your package. It's still gonna have exactly the same amount of juice on the tobacco when you're packing it. To compare when you're using your hands, I spoke to my friend, I asked him why, why do you still using your hands packing the tobacco, your fingers? said so, well for him it was easy to feel the tobacco to put it inside to kind of separate leaves of this tobacco but it's still gonna be messy around a lot of juice from tobacco is gonna stay on your fingers you have to wash it then there is some type of tobacco which are really strong flavor wise and uh, it's gonna be hard to clean your hands afterwards in commercial settings it's better to use fork as when you pack your bowl with uh, your fingers then you are in rush you're gonna grab your base, you need to put water inside and you forgot to wash your hands and it's all messed up and then you're trying to get your tobacco from the floor, from everywhere. So that's why everybody in commercial settings nowadays, uh, most, most of them, they, uh, they're using uh, forks. That's why we strongly recommend to use a fork for our guys, especially for us in commercial settings. For home, yeah, it's uh, for home, you can use hands, whatever, but you always, you have fork, just give it a try. Everybody has fork at home, right? <laughs> Let's just uh, compare, I'm gonna try to pack my uh, bowl with using my hands. I honestly haven't done this for 10 years, maybe, maybe more. I always use fork. When hookah was created, I already used fork. <laughs> honestly, I don't wanna continue to pack and use my hands, as you can see, I have a lot of tobacco on my fingers. Imagine if you pack one bowl, second bowl, third bowl, and like on and on and on all night in uh, commercial settings. And imagine how, how many tobacco you're just gonna wash out to the sink. That's almost half a bowl on my fingers. <laughs> you, can, you can pack, a, literally can pack a bowl. This is how they fluffing out. That's an old school way of packing a bowl. I remember back in the days, I used my fingers to pack a bowl, then I had to clean up the entire kitchen after that. I would say it's more like tradition way. It's up to you guys. Uh, how many people out there are watching? That many opinions we got. Let me go wash my hands and we will continue using our fork. All right, and we're back with our fork. I personally like to use just regular fork from uh, home. I don't know why. The fork especially is good for packing a funnel style bowl. You can grab your tobacco from the bottom has all juice over it, especially for funnel style bowl, as you can see. Nice and easy, juicy, squeezy. <laughs> as I said, fork, very good for packing funnel style bowls. It's simply effective, you keep all juice on your tobacco. You can mix it out of your package, not just like this, but whatever package you have, mix it, grab from the bottom with uh, juicy tobacco put it in press it if you want to press separate leaves if you want to and you still got clean hands you can go get your hook ready and let me show you the different style bowl the more standard one and right now we're going to be using the special hook of fork with the sharp edge on opposite side same technique make it fluffy inside the package get the juicy part as you can see Nice and simple. That's what we gonna be using sharp edge for. I'm just going to be fluffing out. I need to add more tobacco, of course. You got the point. You can make a hole in the middle if you want to. Then if you want to, you can put foil. Foil and make all these perfect size holes. I mean, not perfect. I'm not gonna be smoking this. You got the point. 
that's why uh, people are using forks nowadays it's more professional more clean more faster to everybody who's still using fingers to pack a bowl especially in commercial settings i recommend you wash your hands after every time you touch your tobacco because it gets dirty everywhere keep it clean and use a fork i hope you got all benefits from why people are using forks nowadays if not Leave a comment down below what you think about it, what you're using fork or fingers or hands or legs, I don't know. <laughs> Subscribe to our channel or leave a comment down below. As always, give us a thumbs up, come visit us and see you in the next one. Peace. Oh, I forgot to tell. Subscribe to our Instagram account. That's the first thing. And the second thing is YouTube finally made some uh, tips available for viewers to give tips to a creator directly using YouTube. There is a little heart on the left side, right? Yeah, on the left side. Somewhere over here is optional. And uh, as probably you guys all know, our videos now have been sponsored by anybody. We do it because we love hookah, we love you guys. It's it's up to you if you want to give us uh, some tips to continue for us to grow our channel. But yeah, stay tuned for new videos. See you in the next one. Peace.